two astronauts, far from home, are trapped in space, unexpectedly cut off from Earth for months. How did a short mission turn into an extended stay with no clear way back? Two astronauts from Boeing Starliner, Starliner are now awaiting a decision on when they can return home from space. After nine weeks on the International Space Station, NASA now says mechanical issues with the Starliner could turn their planned eight-day mission into eight months. Imagine this, you're stuck in space, floating miles above Earth. You thought you'd be home in just a few days, but now, weeks have passed. Your spaceship isn't working, and there's no easy way to get back. You look out the window at the endless stars and wonder, when will I see home again? That's exactly what's happening to two NASA astronauts right now. What was supposed to be a short, routine mission has turned into something much longer and far more uncertain. So what went wrong? On June 5, 2024, NASA astronauts Sunita Suni Williams and Barry Butch Wilmore blasted off aboard Boeing's Starliner for a quick mission to the International Space Station. They were supposed to stay for only eight days, but things didn't go as planned. Soon after reaching space, their spacecraft began having serious issues. Helium leaks in the propulsion system and thruster failures. Suddenly, their return vehicle was no longer safe. The astronauts were stuck, and NASA had to make a tough decision to leave them in space for much longer than expected. Let's take a closer look at the docking system. Spacecraft like the one used in this mission rely on a precise mechanical process to attach to the ISS. First, a series of sensors guide the spacecraft toward the docking port, then small motors lock the two vessels together. In this case, it appears that either the sensors failed or there's a mechanical fault that's preventing the locking mechanism from engaging. SpaceX engineers on the ground are reviewing every detail of the spacecraft's data feed, searching for answers. Right now, they're running simulations and developing potential solutions to get the docking system operational again. But this is no simple task. One small mistake could make the situation worse. So how will they get back? NASA has a new plan. They'll return to Earth aboard SpaceX's Crew Dragon spacecraft, but not until early 2025. Until then, Williams and Wilmore will continue their work on the ISS, even though their original mission should have ended months ago. Their new return date is set for February 2025 as part of the SpaceX Crew-9 mission. It's a long wait, but NASA and SpaceX are doing everything they can to bring the astronauts home safely. Even though their stay has been much longer than expected, both astronauts are staying positive. Sunita Williams calls the ISS her happy place, though she admits she misses her family and pets. Barry Wilmore says that they've trained for situations like this, and they're well prepared for the challenges. They've been keeping busy, helping with maintenance on the ISS and conducting important experiments. Still, they're looking forward to their return to Earth. NASA and SpaceX are both working around the clock to make sure everything goes smoothly for their return. The Crew Dragon spacecraft will launch soon to bring them home. And if all goes well, Williams and Wilmore will be back on Earth in just a few more months. It's been an unexpected and long journey but soon these brave astronauts will finally make it home. Until then, the world will be watching closely. What would you do if you were stuck in space for months? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching Worldview. Have a great day.